I'm going to talk to you about the Larghetto movement from Telemann's um, second sonata, second canonic sonata. And one of the first things that I do um, when learning a piece like this and then when studying it is listening to other recordings that musicians have made. So I'll link one of those um, with this video. Um, but one of the ones that I really enjoyed um, was performed on flute by Victor Soma. So I really recommend listening to that and hearing the beautiful phrasing. Um, let's start by looking at the first two measures. Now, this is Larghetto, so it's very slow. This is a 6-8 that we're really going to count in six. I find it really useful to think one, two, three, four, five, six. And of course, since we're thinking in six, this means that some notes, like quarter notes, which in 4-4 four, four would mean one beat, means something else. Because we're counting the eighth note as the beat, a quarter note gets how many beats? If you answered two, you're exactly right. So this first section, we're just gonna play this in first position right now. One, two, three, four, five, You can hear how I let that D be two beats long. We're going to look at that next measure. Um, it has the eighth rest to start. So I start off by counting that off. And there's another quarter note in there. So I remember to give that two beats. Let's start from the beginning. One, two, three, four, five. the beginning of Telemann's Larghetto movement from his second canonic suite.